If you're serious about security and privacy, I want to talk to you about email aliases, which are addresses with the sole purpose to forward any message it receives to your personal email. These aliases typically don't have anything in the address that would reveal information about you, so your identity is protected when you sign up for online services and subscriptions. Why would you even need such a thing? Simple. Say you want to sign up for a company mailing list or receive an email receipt from a purchase, but you don't want to give that company your real email address. For that, you can use an alias. That alias will receive any email and automatically forward it to your actual email address. One of the biggest benefits of using email aliases is it means should that company fall victim to a data breach, your real email address and identity aren't compromised. It's safer, it's more private, and even better, it's easy to do with Bitwarden. Let me show you how. Bitwarden works with five popular email forwarding services, Simple Login, Anonaddy, Firefox Relay, Fastmail, and DuckDuckGo. Let me show you how this is done in the web version of Bitwarden. The trickiest part of this is accessing the API token for the service you use. How you access it will depend on the service. For example, with DuckDuckGo, you have to go to https colon slash slash duckduckgo.com slash email slash choose dash address. Open the web browser inspector, click generate private duck address, and then locate the line that starts with authorization colon bearer. Your API token is what follows. Copy the API token. Go back to the Bitwarden Web Vault and click Tools, Generator. Select Forwarded Email Alias. Select the service you want to use, paste the API key, and then click Regenerate Username. A new email alias will appear at the top, which you can then copy and use. Once you have this set up, anytime you go to Tools, Generator, you can create a new forwarded email alias. And that's all there is to using email aliases in Bitwarden.